taking shelter inside a church in northern Gaza have been killed by Israeli snipers. Some witnesses say the woman was shot in cold blood at the Holy Family Catholic Church. One was killed while she was carrying her elderly mother to safety. That is not the full story. So there are 300 Christians taking refuge in a Catholic church in Gaza. We know they are Christian because two of them are related to politicians in the United Kingdom. Like, so there is no Hamas. So you see this cute little diagram over here? They put a tank outside the church and they shot the generator. And then the facilities manager went out and was like, ah, I gotta fix this generator because we don't have electricity. And the sniper kills him. And unknowing to this mom over here was like, oh, I gotta use the bathroom too. So right around that time where his body's still decomposing, she walks out to go use the bathroom. And apparently he was nice enough to let her use it before shooting at her too. And then her daughter noticed that her mom was being shot at, ran to go save her, and then she got killed by the sniper. I, I like, that's, that's the story. Like, I, I don't know what to tell you. The defense force says didn't happen, wasn't it? Well, I think that's hard to believe, frankly, because uh, the people in Gaza and the Cardinal Archbishop of Jerusalem, they're not given to tell lies. So you don't believe the Israeli Defense Force? No, I don't. Israel is calling the Pope a liar. Like, I, I, granted, they don't have the best track record when it comes to kids, but I think I'm going to believe the Pope on this one.